What's going on YouTube? Bert here, and in today's video, I am doing another guide on decryption, but for the burning mine. In this video, I'm going to show you where all the radio locations are, and hopefully to help you get Elder Ring solo or in a group. So, get ready for it, guys. Remember, the first thing you gotta do is you gotta kill at least eight enemies. So, let's track those sons of guns down. Now, the mutations on this one is the swift movement speed, so they're faster on their feet and in melee, and they also have armor piercing, so try not to get hit, and I am running this as my bloody build, so also, if y'all are questioning if you can do this as a bloody build, the answer is yes. And we are not running silent like they recommend. I recommend just having your fighting build on. You know, ready to go, have your defensive perks. And a couple perks I do recommend having. First off is the first aid, just in case you do start losing health. Have that card maxed out. And secondly, maybe born survivor if you're having a hard time. That is like whenever your health gets like below 30% or so, it will automatically stim pack you. So that's definitely a good one to have when doing something like this. Especially if you are a bloody build you can get like you can get it on the first rank where i think it's when you drop below 20 percent or 30 percent. i'm not too sure but it's very handy i'm i'm not using it because i have my first aid all the way up so when i start losing that health you know i bash the stim packs but yeah doing good so far okay all right let's find the now on this one we gotta guesstimate on which one it is, and I'm gonna guesstimate it's that middle one that has the thing on its head. Now this is the first radio location, so it's gonna be in this room, like we normally do for the uplink, but it's gonna be over here to the wall, and bam, right there. Good work. We're not done. Now if you've played the Burning Mine, you know this location, so. Oh crap. Woo! Woo! Oh, they're getting faster, I feel like. That's okay. Time to bring it the fuck on. I do recommend having a gun on this one that has a lot of ammo capacity. That way you're not having to reload all the time. So, another one of Bird's recommendations. But this one is not too hard to do, guys, especially solo. I'm used to the burning mine, and if y'all are used to it, you should know your way around pretty easy. It's just hunting them down trying, is the hard part. Because they did add, I think, a new section, which is like one of these sections. But okay, never mind. Probably not. <laughs> I did see another section, though, where I was able to go up and down the stairs, which I've never went down before. So, either that's old, or I've never. This thing right here. I don't know if this is old or new, but very nice, very nice. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. They're mad, they're mad, they're mad, they're mad. Be careful, guys. I have Serpendipity on also, just in case I get hit. You know, kind of saves a lot. Miss White growling at me. All right. Try to pick off the right one without raising too much attention. Sir, yes, sir. Vernon Dodge, he knows what's up, you know. Is it that one? Excellent. Yes. Security will start now, the second uplink radio I'm going to show you is surprisingly and one of the first rooms we normally go into. You know the first like radio that you hit to activate the uh, uplink one? Well, in that room has the actual radio interceptor in it. So... Radio number two. Good work. Just one more left. You're clear to engage another group of hostiles. Let's find that final code. You guys, remember this is how you do it solo. And if you are having difficulties with it, don't be afraid to hop in a team. You know, you can get that done super easy. But remember, this is how we do it solo. The cards you're going to need most likely are just the first aid ones to keep yourself alive. And if you want me to go in depth on the builds I'm showing y'all, or that are getting through all of this, let me know in the comments below. And hell yeah. Oh. 
It's like they're all they all have fast movement speed, so they should be running towards me, right? Wrong. I'm not gonna let you survive down here, sir. I'm sorry. We're at seven with five minutes and eighteen seconds. Now to get elder mode you wanna beat it in under eight minutes, remember that. I did not beat it on elder mode yet. So, I'm going to show y'all the rewards I get from it, too. I'm excited. Hopefully, I can get something good. Fingers crossed. Ooh. Ooh. Serpendipity coming in clutch. Oh, crap. Ooh. Oh, no. I knew something was off right there. I knew something was going to happen. That's okay. We're making good time. We got one more to kill. And now when it comes to the boss, if you're cut for time, I do recommend bringing in a heavy hitting gun. That way you can just, instead of freaking out, you can just run in there. I'll show you what I'm about to do. But you can just run in there and smoke his ass. That's what you're trying to do. Ooh. Get off of me. All right. Where is he? I think he's the one up there walking up. Oh, there he is. I don't know what he just said. Butter my brain? I don't know what that means. Boom. Now, the last radio... Oh, crap. The last radio interceptor is usually where the last uplink area is. So... Remember, this is my bloody build, so if you don't mind dying a couple times, sure, go ahead, use your bloody build, it doesn't matter. But, also, a high health build will work. Way better. And boom! That's the last radio interceptor. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Those little bitches. Those little bitches. <laughs> Those little... Bitches. But yeah, let me go. I'll go back over there and show y'all where it is real quick. <sighs> Whoop, my side's getting a little bit blurry. So on uplink, this is where the second radio or the third, the last radio you use is. It's going to be right here. The interceptor radio is literally to its right. It's going to be right there. So yeah, those are all the locations, guys. We did hit elder mode, like I said. This is how you do it solo. The perk cards I do recommend you using are the first aid mask style or born survivor. One of those. And let's see what kind of rewards we got for hitting elder rank. Dun 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 dun. Fingers crossed, something good, something good. Okay, not so good. We're going for the rewards though. Oh my gosh. Also not so good, so. Yeah, that is how you get Elder Rank in the Burning Mines. It's a guide to where all the radios are and all that stuff, but that's how you do it, guys. So, if you're having trouble, make sure to watch this video. Hit the like button. Subscribe for more Fallout 76 content. And, guys, I shall see y'all in the next one. Peace.